Hi guys, this is Bake with Nari and I'm here to share my recipe of uh, eggless brownies. Now these eggless brownies have a beautiful crackly top and they're ooey gooey inside. My niece who is 13 and my nephew who is 9, they just love it and so do all the children around the campus. So let's just dive into it. Now for this brownie recipe, you need 125 grams of dark chocolate. I'm using 55% dark chocolate of Van Newton brand. Then you need 75 grams of uh, salted butter. I'm using Amul. So this is 75 grams of Amul salted butter. Then you need two, two tablespoons of cocoa powder. This is Van Houten brand cocoa powder. Three tablespoons of light brown sugar. Now if you don't have light brown sugar, don't worry. Just uh, take any brown sugar and substitute it for this. Now we take Two, tables, uh, two teaspoons of vanilla essence, 250 ml of uh, condensed milk, this is sweetened condensed milk, 250 ml, that is 250 milliliters, and 100 grams of maida or all purpose flour. Now, for this brownie, we need to melt the chocolate. That is 125 grams of chocolate, 75 grams of butter, the 3 tablespoons of light brown sugar, the 2 tablespoons of cocoa powder, condensed milk and you might wonder why I'm putting all of this together but this is what really gets the crackly top now I'm just going to take these and put them in a double boiler use a double boiler to melt them and I'll just come back Okay, so now we've melted all the ingredients in the double boiler. See how nicely they have melted. And now we're going to add the vanilla essence and the 100 grams of flour. Flour that is maida. Now all we have to do is just mix it well. I have preheated my oven at 175 degrees Celsius. And I'm using a 9 inch brownie pan. Can you see how thick this batter is? And this is what's going to give it the crackly top. When you melt the butter, the sugar and the chocolate all together in the double boiler. Now, 
we will put the batter in the mold in the pan in the brownie pan and can you see how delicious it looks it tastes divine trust me and if you have children in your house you should make this and now this beautiful brownie batter is ready for the oven Now the brownie batter is in the oven. All you have to do is just wait for it to come out and then you will see what I have been talking about. So here is what I promised. I promised you a crackly top. So as you can see, the brownie is absolutely crackly at the top. And I also promised a gooey, gooey, gooey brownie. Can you see that? How, let's see, see how gooey this is. And this is the best brownie in the world. Thank you. No.